Hey guys, it's Todd. I just got this beautiful, oh my god, wow, I'm so in love with this bike. 58 first year dual guide. Just came in. My buddy Matt Waxler from Wheels Through Time, Dale Waxler, I've been friends with them forever. I've known Matt since he was a little tiny kid. And I says, hey man, what's up? He says, I got this. I says, I'll take it. I just love this bike. Oh my god. Let, let me clue you in what this is all about. Oh my god. So this, we're just going to give it a first introductory video to this machine. And I'm going to try to start it. I've, I've had a, a running video, so I know it runs. I just don't know if the battery's charged enough to actually fire it or not. Six volts, they really need their whole six volt to, to run. And haul bikes took forever to get me this machine. So anyhow, we'll bring it out. If it fires, great. If it doesn't, great. Maybe some, maybe don't. I don't know. You're going to see me try to fire it for the first time. So, the blue was the standard option, 57, 58. There's lots of them in this blue color. The white, however, is factory custom paint. On the next video, we'll make a run the meter around it and, and, and I'll wipe it down a little bit. I just want to show it here without being wiped down. It's got this cool custom wheel ring on it. It's got the fender rail, the light, lights on both sides, the little visor. Remember, the spotlights are optional. Okay, it's got an optional turn signal kit that works. Oh my God, it works. Okay, um, got this cool seat with rail on it. The seat was more money. So it's, it's the uh, uh, plastic eye seat uh, called a paneling, I think, something like that. If I remember right. He's making noise in the back. And uh, the turn signals work in the back here. And these would probably be brake lights. I haven't tested that yet. So it's got the little mud flap on it. Of course, the bags are optional, and it's got this cool factory custom paint to the bags to make it match. Normally, they'd just be white. That You gotta order that. It's got the dual exhaust, that's the factory custom option. It's got the chrome outer primary, the chrome oil tank. Again, factory custom options. It has the deluxe floorboards. You better believe that was asked for. With white grips, and what is left of a white kicker pedal is kind of faded. Look at that Speedo. I, I sent Stan one of these to rebuild for me, and I told him, hey, bike's here. So he's redoing another one with this mileage, this exact face, to match, and we'll trade them out. So unfortunately, he's missing the left tank emblem. That's fair enough easy fix. The biggest bitch I have is I'm pretty sure the shipper took the license plate off of it, the original plate, and all this bracketry fell off, which you saw in the shipper photo, and it scurfed the rear fender on this beautiful original paint bike. In this particular rail here, I have never personally seen that. I'm sure some of you guys that have lots of dual glides, I haven't had as many duels as I've had other bikes, although I've had a lot of them, but uh, I haven't had hundreds. But 58. Now, what's really interesting to me is the uh, stand here. That was an optional stand bracket you could get to pick your bike up in the air off of that. The first 58's had it on the left side. I've had one of those frames ever, ever, I mean ever. And uh, that's all I know. Now I'm not positive what this is. It's probably the blinkers, but um, I did test the lights here and all of these are out, but this is working. So that's probably where it all connects in there. Probably fell off in the shipping. And, yep, see that's the spotlights there. That one turn your spotlights on and off. So that, the, the panels in back here for that. And uh, that's probably, it, it got loose or something. So that's easy fix. But uh, look at this. We got, uh, yep. See the blinky? And, you can see it with the dust. So that connector needs to be cleaned, but it wouldn't be blinking if it wasn't there. Let's do it on the other side. That, that, you know, old bikes like this, you always got to go over all your connectors. I can see it. Yep, there it is. Blinky, blinky. You can kind of see it there. So that's your turn signal. Man, all these bikes I've had, I've never had the factory turn signal kit. That's so cool. So cool. So 
So let me see about this rear brake. The rear brake is working, and these should be off the brake, so something that's not connected in there. Easy fix stuff. So, I mean, I'm gonna sell it as I got it. You know, I'm not gonna completely service it and blah, 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 that's all for you. So let's, let's try and fire it up. Gas. <laughs> Forgot to check the gas. Oh, we are bone dry. Never mind. So we're gonna come back and make another video. The starting video. I gotta go get some gas. But man, what a machine! It's got two duals on it, two dual exhaust. So that was a factory option. Let me show you the, the dual section. Remember the green bug had the two dual exhaust? To try and get those exhaust systems today, man, that's hard. Woo, woo, woo. And looky, looky, it's got, that, see that's the optional rear stand. So you could get that, or you could get a jack off of here. That's what that piece is for on the frame. And for those who are unfamiliar with, these early bikes had a down tube step frame here. And then they had a, these mounts here, so you can mount up your Bridges style oil tank, like that. But there's two little brackets in the back of the oil tank that are not there for a rigid. But what a beautiful machine. Oh my God, I am so in love with this bike. What, what a cool, cool bike. And they, they're usually all boogered up and messed up. And people strip this or that off of it. Got the original mirror still. Man. I've had every year dual guide and original paint except for a 58. This is the first original paint 58 I've had. Although I've had 58, just uh, not original paint before. So that's that. We're going to give it another little pan around and I'm going to go put some gas in it. Very upsetting on that rear fender. We're going to get a hold of the shippers on that. Don't use haul bikes, guys. Do not use haul bikes ever. So I'm gonna put a little air in those tires too. But we'll get this video uploaded while I get some gas in. And I forgot to see if those, those are usually either running lights or rear brakes, I forgot to check that. But we'll check it out again once we get it running. And with it generating, we'll have a little more juice. So that's that for now. Talk to you soon.